Kathy with Kathy's Designer Cookies. Welcome to the Christmas tree decorating class. Well, we'll turn this tree into this decorated tree. So welcome to class. I'm so glad you're here. So we're going to learn how to outline it and flood the Christmas tree. So you just follow the edges and the contours of the tree. It doesn't have to be that perfect. All the way around. I like to give it a little bit of a scalloped edge on the bottom. Like this. That's an outline. And you go back in and quickly flood or put lots of icing on there. Don't worry if it's not perfect because we take our little toothpick and we stir in little circles. I'm actually touching the cookie underneath. I can feel the cookie working in little circles around and around just like this to fill in all the little gaps and something to make the cookie extremely smooth. If you don't want to have the cookie have those little bumps and things on it, what I like to do is give it a little tiny shake. What happens is that it will settle out the icing a little bit and will make your cookie very smooth. Once the base of your cookie is dry to the touch, we're ready to decorate the Christmas tree. So I take my white icing, or you can use any color you prefer, and do a very simple garland just like this. You take it to the sugar bowl, sprinkle sugar, and because your base is dry, the sugar will only stick to the wet icing. Now if there's a few little strays on here, you just take a little paintbrush and kind of brush them off. Then you're ready to decorate the tree with little silver balls, a little snowflake, or even a couple of dots of red. Just like that. I hope you've enjoyed this short introduction to creating your own beautifully decorated cookies. But for more information and more ideas, visit my website, kathysdesignercookies.com.